Welcome back to another episode of the AEW Universal Mode. We are on Dark Elevation, and here we are in Chicago, Illinois. So actually, maybe, maybe we should put CM Punk in a match. I don't know. Should we take a... Maybe, I don't know. Nah, just keep it as it is. There will be another day for CM Punk to appear. I kind of like the card how it is. One match to skip. Otherwise, if I just put CM Punk in, there would just be nothing for him. <clears throat> so it's Monday. It is AEW Dark Elevation, and it's Saturday here in the real world. And FTR, I have given them some new updated attires just a little bit. And I have updated the moveset for FTR as well, just a little bit as well, too. And apparently I am teaming up with Cedric Alexander. I really don't like myself because I'm playing as FTR, but when it's a tag team match, oh well. You know, when you have a guy who's not a tag team wrestler, myself, teaming up with someone who I don't even like, or I don't even really know, he's not part of the Anarchists. So, <laughs> you know... Can't be against them. Um, so, obviously you don't know the tag team tournament just yet. You know that there is going to be one coming. Um, but originally I had the Good Brothers scheduled for... Wait, what the fuck? What? 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 MTR is being attacked by ghosts! It... I, I can't. Okay, but make a guess as to who attacked me. Okay. Um. Well. Um. I I guess we're doing this. FDR just got assaulted by somebody. I I. Part of commentary is something that you don't know what happened. You know. But we're just gonna keep fighting. Uh, why I'm giving up with Stegic Alexander, I have no idea. I mean, couldn't they have given me, you know, my, my teammates of the Anarchists? I have been a tag team. I know that, you know, freaking um, Tyler Sister and Zach Hudson are the tag team of the Anarchists, but at least that way I'd be with my teammates. I still have no idea who attacked FPR before the match. The lights were out. You want the lights were out on AW Dark. You want to pretend that one? That was a super kick. Was it the Young Bucks? Did Lucas hire the Young Bucks to attack FTR before the match took place? Sitting the accident in the corner there. No. Lucas power bomb position. Send a big time lariat off the top rope there. And now Dax makes the quick tag to cash. Who am I? Okay, I, I, I am Dax. Go cash! Cash with the TPS! Yeah, buddy! Oh, no, you don't. Man. Yep. Who am I? Okay, now I'm nobody. This is bullshit! Swapped out somehow. Oh, not 
today. Ready to go take it to him, Cash. Cedric Alexander nailing the DDT on Cash Wheeler there. Go for it. I dare you. I dare you. Watch this. Watch this. Yeah, see? Oh, what the hell? Ghost attacks. This is really a. This is an AW Dark. This is AW Paranormal. Sneak attack there from Lucas. Man, I'm so proud. Oh, fold Nelson into a reverse STO style there. Not what I wanted. Cedric Alexander looking for the Lombard check. Oh, smart strategy from Cedric Alexander keeping Cash away in the middle of the rope, keeping it close to the corner where Lucas is at, making it much easier for Lucas to be able to break up or to, to stop Dax from breaking up the submission. Damn it. I was trying to go for, uh, for knocking myself off. Boom! Oh, don't do anything! Oh, I was looking at the wrong person anyways. Damn it. I got ahead of myself. Do it! Me do it! Yeah! Oh crap. Gotta get out of here. I'm, I'm cheating too much. I'm sorry. I love playing as FTR. They're so fun. Because you can play as them as baby faces and heels all at the same time. Uh, wait a sec, Cash Wheeler. What you got planned for Lucas? Into a pile driver! No! Oh, Dax just laying in wait, trying to distract the referee. I'm sorry. Oh, man. Nice counter. Uh-oh. They're just looking for the Brain Buster. And Cash breaking that one up, saving me. Oh, big time running. Big boot there. Face got scraped across the ropes. There. Oh, super kick! No, nope. big time punch. Lucas, like a one-man army, taking on all of FTR. And Dax looking for an elevated suplex position. Bang! That'll allow Cash Wheeler some time to recuperate there. update FTR boots at though so that, that way we're not cheating though. That black handle onto the leg there. Dax the axe with the double axe. Uh, which is interesting because uh, me and uh, Dax also attacked the legs for submissions. Just looking for a, a wrapping the legs around, bang, dropping it down on the knees there. Oh no, Lucas set up in the corner on Dax Harwood for the princess kick. Nobody oh, missed it. The running chop block. Got Dax has got planned for here. Locks it in, the, the leg lock. I felt like my controller was on like, like a staller or something. I don't know what happened. It's weird. It's trying to chase it, but. All right, tagging cash, your turn, blind tag. Yeah, cool. Ow! That's okay. FTR taking full control over this one here. Feels like FTR is on more of a roll since they have 
defeated the Immortals. It feels like that all is right with FTR again. All that handstand leg drop there from Lucas. Setting up for the Prince's kick. Yeah! <laughs> I feel weird that I, that I enjoy hurting myself. There you go, way to go, Cash. Take out the leg there. Oh, taking the midsection. Wait a sec, what does Lucas have planned for? Oh, gut crushing impact. And wait a sec, rebounding off the ropes. And oh, we're going for a low style drop kick there, but Cash Wheeler moving out of the way. Last second there. Oh, and Cash got the hands around the throat, just choking out the life of Lucas. Oh, and there we see Bliss just getting involved in the matchup yet again. Stop the Brain Buster. Oh, exactly what I would have done too. Boom! Uh, small rig, I guess we'll call it. Shit, I'm so sorry. Cash, I'm sorry. Oh no! <laughs> Everyone got taken out. The referee got taken out. I got taken out. Bliss was distracting the referee at the same time there. What a great timing for my for Lucas there. Feels weird referring to myself in third person. Cash right now may have to do this all alone right now. Oh, just scraping the face across the ropes. Oh, that was like right in front of the referee. I was looking at myself. I was looking at myself to be like, you know, hey! Come on. Uh oh. Wait. That's not going out. I'm going to put there. Wait, wait, wait. Where are you going to go? No! I missed it! Oh, I was gonna drop down the ropes and make him and make myself fall out of the ring. Not today, you son of a bitch! Boom! Yeah, he's taken down Lucas with a grapple style takedown. Oh, I don't have the stamina for that. Damn it! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Boom! Ah, oh, Cash! That was your time to take advantage of that! Yeah, do it! Yeah! Wrong with tag team move. Tag team. Cash! Yeah! And a vintage DDT there. No. Wait, wait. Oh, nice roll through. Take out the leg. Oh, no. Nice. Thanks, Cash. Looking for the suplex. Dax looking for that big time elevated suplex there. FTR cheating as always. I want the blind tag in. Oh, never mind. You got this one, Cash. Oh, okay. Tagging in to the best man. Wait, what if I interrupt this? <laughs> I'm just curious. Lucas sizing up for the Prince's kick, but Dax is right there. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Cash, wake up! Wake up, Cash! I can't hold him much longer. Eh, as strong as I am. Oh, God! Got him right there. Wait, don't do it! Don't go for the long blow. It's not going to be long vacation.
I'll knock out. Oh, the small rig. I was targeting uh, Cash by accident there, but that worked out just as well. Oh, no, it's a submission. Don't make me tap out. There you go. Thank you. I don't like tapping out. I may be a heel, but I ain't no quitter. There we go. Tag team action. I got you. I wanted this match anyways, too. Wait, why am I looking at you, Cash? Oh, shit breaker there. No, hey. I says triangle for the comeback, but I won't let me do it. Oh, roundhouse kick there. Lucas is taking full control over this matchup here by himself. Dax Harwood looking for a little bit of comeback here. Nice Lariat take down a second Lariat. Grabs the leg and chops it out. What's my other signature? Oh, into the cutter. No. Oh, dang, look at me go. Oh, stepping on the hand. And oh, it's crushing the arm. That Dax locks the legs. The legs are locked in. Lucas may have no choice but to tap out. Oh, wait. I didn't want to make myself tap out. I said I don't make me tap, and yet I made myself tap. <laughs> so, but who attacked FTR? Dax Harwood and Cash Wheeler got attacked, but by who? I guess that's the thing that we'll have to wait and see when we read the news of who. Who? 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 Now we go to our next matchup. Now, there is a story behind this. Why are Paul White, Bo Dallas, and Curtis Axel and Roderick Strong all together here? Well, that's because they're missing someone. Chris Jericho. Yes, I got silly. And I created my own Jericho Appreciation Society. I um, couldn't get Danny Magic or uh, uh, Matt Menard. Because, uh, again, I have no custom creation slots left. So I found, well, what characters can I utilize? And I was like, well, sure. Let's, let's get these guys. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by the big show, Bo Dallas and Curtis Axel. <laughs> Curtis, Curtis, big keep up. I got to keep jogging. <laughs> Axel says, get the fuck out of my way, Paul. Now, does Roderick Strong really fit with the whole sports entertainers thing? No, probably not, but I couldn't really find anyone else. I just, you know. Maybe I could have put in Johnny Elite, I don't know, but I just don't really see anything that he has. But then again, you know, would you see freaking... Uh, um, Daniel Garcia as a quote-unquote sports entertainer. Nah, you really wouldn't, so. Gotta have one of those guys, I guess. So here we go. It's the debut of the Jericho Appreciation Society all together in the first moment. And we know that Chris Jericho is in the back watching this on in the locker room. As Roderick Strong takes on Leo Rush. 
Ref calls for a clean break and Leo Rush will give it. And so will Roderick Strong. Strong control in the arm there of Leo Rush. Oh, now just chop it down strong and still working that arm. Leo now down to a single knee. Or he was. Kick to the midsection there. Oh, Leo Rush slapped to the face there. A nice movement there from Roderick Strong. Popping up with a Hurricanewana and a running STO there. Gotta say, I love that, you know, Bo Dallas. Like, the thing that I hate the most is that, you know, when the wrestlers have custom attires and their managers, they don't get to keep their entrance attires if you don't list them as a manager. But it's like, what if I want to have two different, you know, attires? You know, they don't get to keep that. You know, Bo Dallas, you know, looks better as the quote-unquote sports entertainer. Yeah. Oh, running calf kick. I think that Leo Rush fell hard in his chest there. But if I, it looked as if he like got caught on the ear there by Roger Strong. And the 10 beats into the turnbuckle pad there. Strong keeping a firm control over Leo Rush here in the early goings of this matchup here. Oh, just solid straight punch to the face. Leo gonna have to start utilizing his speed to his advantage. Strong has got the strength over him. No pun intended on that one. And the striking capabilities as well. We know what Leo Rush can do with his strikes as well too. But definitely, you gotta give Leo Rush the speed advantage over this matchup. Which is what Leo Rush is utilizing right now with that calf kick there. But Strong just keeps coming back with more. And returns fire with his own calf kick. Oh, wait a second. Leo Rush has put himself on the wrong side. It's on the side of the Jericho Appreciation Society out there. You see that Curtis Axel was getting really close out there. Ball kick to the midsection there. Leo blocked whatever Strong was looking for. Oh, rolling Death Valley driver there. One. On the account of one there. Leo in the corner looking for that sliding kick. Oh, but you see Bo Dallas up on the ring apron there. But, oh, look at the height that Leo Rush was looking for on that frog splash. But Strong caught him with the knees. My God. I mean, when you put so much elevation on that right there, uh, well, no pun intended on that one. Again, elevation. <laughs> when you put so much elevation on that one, and you just fall hard on the knees of someone, it really just takes the wind right out of you. But Leo Rush fighting through the pain in this matchup to push through that. Oh, Strong, what's he looking for? Oh, Butterfly Suplex there. I believe Leo's toe was just under the bottom rope there. Forcing the referee to call for a break. Nice drop kick there from Leo Rush. Strong pulling himself up by the ropes here. Oh, but he may have just been baiting in Leo Rush as he drops him throat first across the ropes. Another big time drop kick there from Leo Rush. And for a scoop slam or a Mitch Noku driver, whatever it was he was looking for, Strong was not, was not gonna let him hit it. Now wait a sec, Roderick Strong taking off the turnbuckle pad. While not encouraged, it is not, while not illegal, it is just not applauded. But it appears that Strong may have regretted doing that as Leo Rush made him pay for even thinking of utilizing such tactics. Strong control of Leo by the back of the neck there. But Leo was not gonna just sit around and wait forever. Oh, kick to the inside leg. Strong throws Leo Rush in. Oh, into the cutter! Uh, into the cover! One! Only a count of one there again. Let's move the, I mean, the determination that Roderick Strong has here. He knows that the new, he knows that his leader, Chris Jericho, is watching backstage carefully. 
and does not appreciate any embarrassment in Chris Jericho's eyes and it's an honor to be chosen before the Jericho Appreciation Society. A big time Larry there, but a miss. Strong with a hard Irish whip into the ropes. Wait a sec. Ice Tiger suplex there. Or, that's not... Is that the ti Tiger driver? Whatever it is. One, two. Oh, about a two and a half count right there. Strong keeps looking for that overhand strike there that Leo Rush keeps countering out of it. Now four on him across the face there. Oh, solid knife edge chop across the chest there. Woo, that one hurt me just, just looking at that. A strong fireman's carry position. Oh, and the butt crusher there. Keep in mind that Leo may have some damaged ribs there after coming down hard on the knees from that frog splash. And you see it did the damage. It wasn't enough for a three count, but that was a two and three quarters count right there. Oh, nice pullback DDT there. Leo Rush in the cover. Oh, but Bo Dallas yet again posing for a distraction there from the referee. Oh, but Leo Rush. May have said it's only a matter of time. The rolling of prettier. One, two. Uh oh. <laughs> Bo Dallas is absolutely furious about the outcome there. Bo Dallas did everything that he could for Roderick Strong, and it still wasn't enough. As Leo Rush managing to pick up a victory, Leo Rush would not be denied a win here over Roderick Strong. Perhaps Chris Jericho may have to go back to the drawing board as to who the final member of the Jericho Appreciation Society should be. Let's do, let's be shameless. Why not, fellas? Right. Uh, well, next we go to our next contest. It'll be Public Enemy number one taking on the bar, Sheamus and Cesaro. And keep in mind that Public Enemy number one is in the tag team tournament. I don't think Sheamus and Cesaro are. No offense to them, but haven't really they haven't really been on the show much. And partially that's my fault, but you know. When you got a lot of teams and a lot of people, it's kind of hard to do that. Don't you know what I mean? Should we get the jazz music back? Why not? For a little bit, we'll do some jazz. Oh, you know what? High stakes here. That's too loud. I'm sorry. High stakes here. Public enemy number one will be defending their spot against the bar. That's what we're going to call this. This is the spot for public enemy number one. If they lose this matchup, they will be ousted from the tag team tournament. And it will be given to Sheamus and Cesaro. Or should I call it? Should I call him Claudio? I wanted to get Claudio's new attire. So here's the thing: is I think that 2K finally cut the servers for the doubt for the community creations on 2K19. So there will be no more new wrestlers of like any AEW guys or whatnot uh, on 2K19, um, which absolutely sucks. You know, it's just like. Nobody, nobody plays 2K20, man. Just keep, just you can take off those servers, but why don't you keep the, you know, 2K19s available? And 
I mean, one day maybe we'll do, you know, 2K20, uh, 2 universe mode. I don't know. I tried doing. S Never mind. I won't, I won't. I won't spoil anything just in case it, I can get it working. But, you know, for the most part, this is the this is our main universe mode. This AEW universe mode, which I think we've got, you know, some pretty good content here. I think you guys, you know, some of you appreciate, you know, what goes on. Oh, but why? oh, what the hell? What the? Why would you do that? I, mean, I guess it's better that you use the kip up rather than using the low blow because you will get disqualified. So, but I think you guys would much rather hear me talk about the match instead of you know extra bullshit. Oh, nice move there from Claudio. I'll try. I'll try to go with Claudio. Sheamus can be Sheamus. <laughs> that makes no sense. Yeah, Sheamus, you can be Sheamus for a little bit longer. Oh yeah, but I better be Sheamus. You know, fucking agent. Jay was taking full control over Nick Wilson here. And unfortunately for Wilson, there is nobody on the... Oh, wait, what's this? Sheamus bringing Claudio in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Claudio on the top of Sheamus' shoulders. And Sky drops Senton. And you can see Max Stone trying to call for Nick Wilson to make a tag to him as he's in desperate need for it. Wilson was refusing to make the tag there for a second, but he does a smart thing and makes a tag right now. Max Stone is the stronger of the two men, or is the strongest of the team there between public enemy number one. But unfortunately for him, Sheamus and Claudio have got strength for days, and especially in Claudio's case, he's got uppercuts for miles. Nice Yuranage slam there though. Oh, Max Stone. Oh, was well, looking for some type of throw there, but Claudio countered it with another European uppercut there. Forearm strike right to the, the back. Or to the face, excuse me. Oh! Jumping foot stomps, Claudio just utilizing everything that he has got. The strength and speed of this Swiss Superman. Off throwing Claudio into the turnbuckle and a German suplex to follow suit. Oh, small uppercut right there and Claudio. And the suplex, no! Perhaps that's just what public enemy no, uh, number one needed was to bring in Max Stone. Clearly he's the one man army right now that the matchup needs. Oh, big time spear! Oh, wait a sec, what's Stone looking for? Oh, the devastation! Damn it! What's going on? Oh no! Nick Wilson taking out Sheamus! I'm trying to get out. Luther is Preston! Public enemy number one really taking full control over this entire matchup over the bar right now. Max Stone knows exactly what's on the line here. Some people have critiqued that Public Enemy Number One doesn't really deserve to be in the tag team tournament, as the brackets were revealed. Oh, oh drop kick position! Claudia was calling to the fans too much, thinking about the swing. Claudio catching Nick Wilson. Military drop into a Michinoku there. You can see Seamus calling for the tag there, but Claudio opts to go for a pin instead. Claudio, take me in. There we go, smart boy.
Sheamus makes the blind tag, which is ex exactly what he needed. Claudio needed that break there. Oh, uh, Sheamus Fireman's carry position. Nick Wilson breaking out of it. Elbows to the side of the head there. Dropping it down and knee strike onto the knee. Uh oh. Nick Wilson sizing Sheamus up. Sheamus up for the jumping knee strike. And Claudio posing for a distraction, giving Sheamus a little bit more time to recover. Oh, uh, that distraction was enough to allow Sheamus to get some more time to recover after that knockout knee strike. Oh, big time, big boot. Sheamus is pushing all of his weight into Nick Wilson. Oh, and the Irish curse. Two. A third curse. The third cursor. Oh, Sheamus thinking about a big time bro kick. No. Nick broke out of it. Fireman's carry position yet again. Wilson breaking out. Let me use my comeback. Are you not sports entertained? Sheamus got double axe handles. And into a power slam there. Oh, no! Nick Wilson rolls to the back door. Oh, double axe handle across the face. Nice jawbreaker there. And don't, don't touch my partner. It's my friend. It's my brother. Oh, no, Claudio awakened. Nice move, Claudio. Yeah, go for the blind tag, Claudio. Oh, wait, I'm Claudio right now. Whoops. Oh! Claudio is trained in the, in the art of the brogue by Sheamus. And to the neutralizer. Oh, crap. Okay, usually I stay. Usually I stay as the guy that I'm um, that I chose, but I want to play as Claudio for a little bit. Oh wait, 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 wait! Ooh, devastating DDT there. You call me out. You call me out. God, what I wanted? Are you kidding me? Oh, referee no selling, Claudio? I should go for a swing on you. Oh, here we go. Got two big boys in the ring. Max Stone and Claudio. One on one. The Swiss Superman Claudio Springboard European uppercut. Eye bleeding? Usually it says opponent bleeding to give me some more, um, even more star rating, but this time it did. Ooh! That still just pushes me away. Ooh! Sorry, I just keep saying goose sometimes. Still looking for a lariat! Claudio shows up with an uppercut. Claudio in the corner could be thinking about that broke. Boom! No! No boom! Okay. Oh, wait a sec, Stone. 
Locks in the Boston crowd, but Claudio just right there are the ropes. Oh shit, nothing. Nice, Yuranage slammed there. Claudio just using, utilizing his entire body to dodge strikes and just. Oh, Byron's carrying position. Ooh. Punch right to the head. Another one. Oh my goodness! Big time Falcon Arrow there! Hey, stop arguing. Seriously, I don't need you. Okay, how do I how do I do the top of the swing? Yes! 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 Here we go. No! Countered it! That's my problem. I love I love doing the taunt for the swing. I should have tag I should have tagged Seamus. Oh, sorry, bud. <laughs> this, this referee loves getting hit. Oh, standing switch! Got crushing impact there. Oh, full off to the face there. Fireman's carry position. Oh, wait a sec, Claudio! With the airplane spin! Oh, what time slot are we looking at? Okay. Still got a little bit of time here. And switches to the other side! I'm getting dizzy just watching this, folks. Oh, it's so is Claudio, he, who falls down. Bah! Double cannons! Fire! Claudia with the end. Fart and tombstone! Call for it! Claudio calling for the swing, and the fans will oblige. They want to see it. But Max Stone doesn't want to see it. so bad, I know I shouldn't do that. You should just stop going for the swing. But you got to give the people what they want. Oh no. Our stone doesn't care about what the people want. Oh, fish drop. Wait, not done a second. Not done a third fish drop there. I think Claudio's hard headed. Oh, wait a second. Big time running power slam there. This match is taking a turn for the worst for the Swiss Cyborg. All what you want, the Swiss Superman, the Swiss Cyborg, the Swiss Army Knife. Claudio's got a thousand nicknames, folks. The uppercut machine. Oh. Oh man, Max Stone showing off a little bit of his agility. Oh no, just tossing Claudio up in the air and letting him fall. Oh, is he going for a spear? Isn't that his signature? Oh, no! Nice! Wait, 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 wait. He's debuffed. Come on! Claudio called for the swing! And the fans are gonna get it! This one may never end! The swing may never stop! And he got it! Claudio in for the pin! Oh, but Nick Wilson breaking it up last second there. Oh, we look. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. I got you. Get back in the corner, Seamus. It is your turn. Finish him off. I'll get Nick. 
Okay, I won't, because he used his powerful knee. Where are you going? Seamus, where are you going? Where are you going? Give my friend a little bit of a break. Come on, Seamus! Call you. I think I should make the bar baby faces. Feels weird to call it to make them heels right now. Like, what's so bad about the bar, huh? Unless they were the mystery people who attacked FTR. That's a different story. Go for the broke, Seamus! Ooh! Feels like Seamus was looking for a discus punch there, but Max Stone caught him with something. Stone just in full control. Oh, pop up into the punch. Nice gut wrench there. Seamus broke! Oh, I see what you want. Okay. Nice kick to the stomach there. How much time is that we're looking at? Okay, so that's pretty good. I feel like we should be able to finish this matchup in time before we go to the second part. Finish it, Sheamus! Finish it! Oh, look at that. Triple Irish curse. Danhausen would be proud of this curse. Stone throwing Sheamus in the corner of his tag team partner. Oh, Sheamus, just throw him. Throw him, don't drag him. Oh, smart. He knew he was going to... I knew he was going to escape there. Oh, it's the spear, but Seamus dodged it. Oh, both men. Stone's got blood in his face, and Seamus with sweat in the eyes. Olympic slap! Oh, what? Wait, now I'm Seamus. Okay. Well, if that's what, who you want me to be, game, then I will be Seamus. Okay, now I'm nobody. It took me away. This is bullshit! Who am I? Now I can't be anybody. I wanted to be Claudio. So, make me, make me be Claudio again. Thank you. Oh my god. This struck the power of the uppercut. Claudio with a tope suicida. Claudio not stopping. Two. Oh man. Claudio going after everyone. This man is insane! Oh man, Max Stone putting his strength to good use to stop the momentum that Claudio had. Oh no, that's a spear! And for the cover. Oops. Nice kick out there from Claudio. That's count of two. Max Stone just trying to figure out what is the next game plan here. That just probably echoed at you guys here. For those who are potentially listening on the headphones. Ooh, Fisherman Suplex. That was deep. I would have I would have tagged you in, Seamus, but I was so close to the ropes. Oh, Max Stone. I thought he was going to go for the swing. But I rarely give the swing to anybody. Trapping the arm there behind the head. But Claudio escapes with a gut punch. 
Oh, and the uppercut. And Stone, center of the ring. Where it was, the sharpshooters in place. Nick Wilson not, not wanting to help at all. This is for all the marbles, Wilson. I could have ended that one, but it just, it just felt weird. Nothing was happening. Uh-oh, pop up into the gut. Suplex. Oh, I'm too close to make the tent, to make the jump. Eh, let me walk away. Okay. It's okay, Shins. Oh. Oh, man. Hip toss with a choke slam behind it. Oh, no. Claudio. Now what? Nick Wilson. Oh, you son of a bitch. You son of a gun. And I can't use the agility since none of you guys have it. Very well. You're entering an Irish fighter. Oh shit. Oh man, Dick Wilson with the hammer throw there and just sending Claudio out to the ring the hard way. I think we should continue this into the next part. I think that's what we'll do.